This door is locked and cannot be opened. Well, thankfully, this genius opened up a hatch for us. <laughs> Those League of Shadow guys being so helpful. They are just the most helpful bad guys in the world. Oh, oh. Now I do have to watch out for my head, do we? Oh. Man. They don't know that oh, I... Oh, God, duck. Woo-hoo! <laughs> Ah, it was a close one. Oh, we're at the go. door. I think this is the door. We're no longer going to be stopped by a black shadow. Dad, why are you trying to blow up Gotham? <laughs> Dad. 208, we played Fallout 3, but it's not the same. Hello? Oh. Oh, I think, I think this is it. Look at all them explosives here. Just standing up. Defying laws of physics. All right, how do I take these guys out? Two of them have guns, Dewey. Maybe it has something to do with these. Uh, I, it these doesn't. Things. Can we can we get around this somehow? Um, how about, how about double back? We got any way to go down? Oh we yeah, do there we go. We have a way to go down. Do oh, we? we have to go way, go around too. Oh, um, not this side. Maybe the other side. Whoop. Uh oh. I got you. I ain't gonna it's let you down, Dewey. It's away. Once we reach the center of Gotham, once we reach the Water Authority, there is no more Gotham. Oh my, Dewey, there's going to be no more Gotham. Man, Bruce Wayne slash Batman, balls of steel. I couldn't, I couldn't do this. I'd be too terrified. Muscles of steel, Dewey. Yeah, Muscles that true, of steel. that true. For this. That too, that true. You know, same thing. It's true and it's too. All right? That is well, <laughs> that is true. <laughs> I'm gonna go. Batman. Now I'm gonna go mess these guys up, Dewey. I'm so sorry, you guys. I hope you forgive me someday. Oh no! The lucky that didn't kill us. You guys, you might think the word is lucky, I'm but Batman. I got bats on your brain, sir. Oh, I hope. Oh, that'd be super cool if they did something with that in Arkham Knight. You can call in a swarm of bats to terrify a certain enemy. Oh, oh. You, I, that's Stop my job. Cutting us. Yeah. The one guy who's just frightened of the bats and he's just in the corner huddled. He's a, <laughs> he's a mess, Dewey. Well, the area of fear, it, it's, it's near maximum. That's right. I'm going to oh. go take care of your friend first. This guy with a sword. Look at he, him. He was, he's so scared. He's getting a little courage, but uh, not enough. He's got a heart rate of 136, 138. It's just going up. I just got to have a heart attack soon. He can't do nothing to me, dude. He's in the corner. 141. Oh, 145 before he gone. And now it's zero. Picked him so hard. He doesn't have a heart rate anymore. You, crushed, you gave him cardiac arrest. Crushed his brain and his heart stopped because oh. of that. Oh. Yep. Batman doesn't know how to hold back his punches, do he? Bond the vents. Now, I know you couldn't do the side hanging thing, but you could do this, right? Oh, yeah, this is this totally is... different and better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. It is. <laughs> and so you'd have no problem with it, I'm sure. Uh, oh, God. We made it to the front. Is this the engine? It's possible. Or, or am I just being. Yep, I, I not believe we've made trains. it. Oh, there was a guy behind me. Oh. I freaked out a little bit in my head. Roz, we're here for you, buddy. Come on, let's fight. I got the checkpoint. You can't stop me even if you wanted to, Roz. There he is. You he gonna try. about theatricality a bit literally, don't you think? We both wear masks. But yours is a lie. You hate this city as much as I do, but you're afraid to do what's necessary. That's why you cannot fight injustice. Why you cannot stop this train? Who said anything about stopping it? Then you will die with the rest of them. There's only one man I'll let you kill. That yourself. Because you can do yourself better than anyone else. <laughs> Just kick him out of the way right away. Yeah, I'm fighting like your goon, sir. Not the rest of you. All right, while he's coughing and sputtering, I'm going to go after this guy. Okay. You know, I'll just let him cough and sputter all he wants. I'll yeah, wear him down a little bit. He gone. That, that vulnerability is gone now. now. Oh, it's back. I got it back. Multiple attack. Oh. Let him wake up a bit. Come to his senses before I kick his butt, you know? I don't yep. want it to be an unfair fight against the League of Shadows' final boss. Whoop, whoop. Sorry, going after your, your buddy first, Roz. Give me a second. 
It's Batman. There's never a fair fight. That's Let's true. Let's be honest. Here, good point. Oh, sorry, Roz. Just you and me now, buddy. What you got? And you know what that means. That means Roz al Ghul. You know, oh! oh. Well, what does it mean for Roz al Ghul, Dewey? Tell me. You're weak, Wayne. You always have been. Oh, jeez. Oh, dude, what am I gonna do? We gotta, we gotta glide, grapple. <laughs> Got Ooh. it. I made it. Now we have to chase him through the carts. Come back here, Ra's al Ghul. I'm gonna stop you. He used his own, our own move against us. He did. What a monster, Dewey. Now, there's no med kit back there. Okay, don't need it, but just in case. You know, I wanna be you gotta know foolish. where all your options are. That's right. Med kit there. No, micro. We found the microwave emitter, Dewey. We Let's found turn it. it off. Let's unplug it, right? The machine cannot be stopped. Oh, God. Whoop! You can't hit me! <laughs> Stupid. Yeah, what you gonna do, Dad? Sorry, now I'm calling him Dad. See, this is what happens. Where is his health bar? That's what I want to know. He doesn't have one, do he? He's, I just gotta beat the crap out of him until he beats the crap out of me. It's just like you somehow managed to kill him now, even though you're not supposed to. <laughs> I'm just got him back in the corner. He can't touch me. He should be afraid. Yeah, be afraid. Have you finally learned to do what is necessary? I told you there's only one man I've let you kill. If not murder, what do you call this? Justice. I knocked the crap out Alfred, of your brain. Detonate the Batmobile. Detonate Are the Batmobile? No, don't, do, don't detonate the Batmobile. I feel like detonate might have a different meaning than we think it does. <laughs> Apparently. According to the Batman universe. Ooh. Razzle Ghoul, I don't think you're living past that. No, I don't think he did. You might have to go visit those pits again. The Arkham Batman would have saved him, though. Yeah? Yeah. The Arkham Batman would have not let him die. He'd give him, always give him a second chance. Well, not this Batman. Not this Batman. Batman I once said, made oh, the mistake done. of thinking Ra's al Ghul was dead. But when men make themselves symbols, they shed their mortality. Henry Descartes and Jonathan Crane are already gone. Just like Bruce Wayne. He's only a mask, a cover for the face criminals now fear. All that's left is Batman. Woo, my reputation ranking is Dark Knight. I'll take it. I think that's the game. We're going to oh. find out when I hit continue here right now. There it is. Save game complete. Oh, and I saw credits there. Yeah, of course credits where we'll always go ahead and talk about what we think this game how it was yeah it's like our, our little mini review of that's how, right of the game that we had just played i had to decide where i wanted to save it didn't uh, know but here are the people who have made this game the loading screen made it <laughs> is, is who who did well you know so tui wh what did you think um, you know, I wasn't sure what to exactly expect from this game, and I know that there were some pre-warnings from people in chat, and also you that's like, eh, you know, I'm not sure, but I liked it. I thought it, it had a good take on the movie. It wasn't, you know, one for one playing through the movie, but it had its own little kind of storyline, and that was yep. cool. I like that, and uh, I, I mean, I didn't get a chance to play. Maybe I will uh, just try, like, a I level would, two. I would say give it a shot just so you can understand the, the the few moments where I'd maybe be frustrated with like the combat, it's obviously not on par with the Arkham series as far as the combat goes, but it is still fun to play, and when you do manage to pull off one of those fear moves or something like that, very satisfying. And that was a big reason for playing this, is kind of wrapping our, our heads around what these fear takedowns can be, because... That is something that is going to be a part one way or the other in Arkham Knight. That's right. So. I'm very excited for that. I know that this game, back in the day when I first played it, 
was teaching me about already about taking down the guy, the biggest guy in the room, or mm -hmm. you know, the guy with the, the gun. Take them out first. Everyone else will then be afraid of you. I did that in in the Arkham games previously, and because it didn't have that concept in the game itself, it didn't always work. But if the, if they're putting in fear takedowns into Arkham Knight, which they are, seeing what the rest of that gets fleshed out with. Man, with that kind of mindset, it's going to be amazing. It's crazy looking at the credits and seeing that the audio team consisted of two people. Ooh. It's just for <laughs> for a game nowadays, you know, of course there's the indie games, but for a AAA game or a movie time game, yeah. you're generally going to have, you know, a, a, a full team. team on that. Yeah. Um, well, you're, you know, the there's mates. another audio guy. The one guy, though, for that, for that <laughs> group of people. But, you know, it's. This game was really fun back in the day. It's still fun now. I mean, I know a lot, so a lot of people have said in our comments that they need to break out their PS2s, you know, their old systems, yeah. and just to play it. And, I mean, if if we've inspired you to go do that, do it. You'll have yeah. a great time. And you can always come back and check us if you get stuck. Yeah, <laughs> we, we, try to, we try to provide the best gameplay that we can. And... Uh, it's a lot of fun. It's always fun adding on to the, the Batman repertoire and learning more about the universe, mm -hmm. whether it's Nolan or, you know, New 52 or whatever it is. Right. Um, I always like learning more, and that's what this game definitely presented. I, I thought I was going to not like it as much as I did. I thought, like, going into it, this is going to be really bad because it's old and it's going to be cheesy, but we'll be able to laugh at it and just kind of uh -huh. have a good time. And then we played like the first hour of it and I was like, I can't even have that opinion anymore. Because <laughs> yeah, it is old and it's still, you know, so, it's a little cheesy in parts, but it's actually for what it is, pretty damn good. Yeah. And I'm just, I love going back and playing things. I know people have talked to us about doing Batman Vengeance and the Rise of Sin Tzu, which we've looked at. Mm -hmm. We were discussing that if we want to do that, but it looks promising. Yeah, if there are any other games that you guys want to see us play on the road to Arkham Knight, we're more than happy to at the very least consider them, more than likely play them, because uh, there's, there's still quite a few Batman games out there that have not even been mentioned, let alone played. Right. So. Well, I know for a fact that upcoming we're going back in time with our Lego Batman series from doing the very first Lego Batman game next. Yeah. I hope that's... We've not touched that. So no. both of us, I think we're kind of... We're, we're hoping it's going to be just as good as the second one. Then we'll have time to even... We'll know exactly what we're doing when Lego Batman 3 comes out. Oh, it's going to be... It's, that's going to be fun. So I hope yeah. you guys stick around. We have a ton of content coming up that's pretty much all Batman related in yep. addition to us going to PAX. Yeah, we're going to have watching a, this, we might be there a now. lot of super awesome things to show you coming out of PAX, so look forward to those on the channel. Um, lots, of, lots of awesome games that we're going to have the opportunity to see a little bit early at PAX and uh, share with you our experiences that we'll have there. So Absolutely. Make sure you're watching this channel every day to see that kind of stuff And you know, up. Raymond, the best way to do that is by hitting that subscribe button. There's also a ton of different ways that you can find out and just kind of peer into our lives. We have mm -hmm. Facebook, Twitter. All these links are in the description. Instagram. Yep. Twitch. It's it's all over the place, and we're, uh, we're happy to share every moment with you guys. So go ahead and look for those and follow those uh, different various social medias. And you know, I think we'll see you guys in the next game. Sounds good to me.